And another thing, I don't want anyone to mention the hospital while Jamie is here, all right? I want him to have a nice day. All right. Happy Thanksgiving, Hilda. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Wheeler. The same to you. Well, have you heard the good news? Hey. Jake's in the hospital, so Paulina won't be dragging him over to ruin our day. Well, you almost got killed helping prove Kevin's innocence, Iris. Oh, I don't think it was anything that heroic, Matthew. How is Jake doing? Well, unfortunately, he's going to survive, so you don't have to spend your time worrying about him. Excuse us. I thought we agreed we wouldn't be openly hostile towards Jake, for a very good reason. Oh, Rachel, I'm sorry I forgot. I was so glad that I wouldn't have to play games with him that I let my feelings run away with me. Well, try to control yourself. Definitely. Well, I have to go. I'm going to the hospital to help Hank bring Tommy home. Oh, that's wonderful. That'll be lovely, even if it is just for a couple of days. Well, I think Tommy deserves to have the day with his father. He's such a, he's such a good father, you know? You're getting very involved with our family. Is it just Tommy or the father, too? Oh, goodness, no. It's just Tommy, of course. Heavens. <laughs> Hank is hardly my kind of man. Ah. Well, shall I save a place for you? Yes, uh, I'll be back in plenty of time. I don't understand how the hospital can be taking so long to make the decision about Jamie. I mean, they'll reinstate him. They have to. Well, if they don't, his medical career will be all but over. That's why I'm worried about him. Dopey. It's been a long time since I've had the chance to play ball with my son. But Jamie, the hospital, it will... will make its decision when it needs to. Until then, I am going to enjoy myself with my family. I'm fine. Really, I am fine. 